uh, managing uh, uterine polyps uh, is relatively an easy procedure. So uterine polyps manifest itself usually in um, causing heavier uh, cycles, uh, menstrual cycles. Uh, sometimes it can cause uh, irregular bleeding in between periods. Uh, the main way the uterine polyps are diagnosed is with the use of ultrasound. Uh, on a general ultrasound done in the office or by an imaging center, sometimes they can be missed. So if there's a woman that's having heavy bleeding and on ultrasound we don't see much, usually the next step is to do what's called a sonohistogram, where we put some uh, saline into the uterus and uh, evaluate what the, if, if there's something growing within the cavity. If a polyp is diagnosed on ultrasound, then the next step would be to remove that polyp. Now, if it's small enough, it can be monitored, um, and we can try medical management to see if we can just control the bleeding um, without having to remove it. But if you're going to remove it, uh, it's an outpatient procedure. It's done under general anesthesia, um, uh, and we go in vaginally and enter the uterus with a small camera. And once the polyp is visualized, it can be easily removed with either polyp graspers or there's other procedures called uh, Myasure where you're uh, removing it under direct visualization. And um, with a 15-20 minute procedure, uh, the problem can be solved.